all right guys in today's video we're gonna address a new problem by facebook if you live streaming to facebook facebook has announced something that's kind of concerning which is they're gonna be deleting your live streams from their platform so basically usually if you stream on youtube and your live stream once it ends it actually stays as an on-demand video right which means people can still watch it as a video even like you know 15 years i don't know maybe 15 years 10 years from now i don't know maybe they're gonna change that policy but as of now the video or the live stream is gonna stay there for as long as you want right so they're not gonna delete it it used to be the same thing with facebook they will leave the live stream after the fact and it will stay there as a video on demand and they will keep showing it to people so they can watch it as a video so now things have changed i think facebook is trying to save some storage cost or servers their servers maybe they are getting full and uh, they're not getting maybe the return on investment or it's probably has to do with people who watch videos on youtube maybe people are not watching those live streams after the fact i don't know any reasoning behind it but the fact is facebook is gonna start deleting those live streams after 30 days so if you go live on facebook you stream after the fact it's gonna get saved and it's gonna stay on facebook for 30 days after 30 days it's going to disappear so now if you were using this method to kind of archive your your stuff on facebook this is probably a good time to be able to live stream and record at the same time maybe or so you can keep a copy of your live stream and if you want to use it for other stuff maybe making short form content making clips and things like that you can use that recorded content that you recorded locally when you were live streaming or another thing that you can actually do is since you still have 30 days you could yeah stream and then before it gets deleted just remember to go there and download a copy of your live stream and keep it as you know a piece of content that you can use again depending on what you want to do with it either for short form content or clipping and things like that so that's my advice but again this is a warning please please be aware that if you're live streaming to facebook they're gonna be deleting your live streams that you have there after 30 days okay so now what i'm gonna do guys to be able to help you again the best solution if you want to keep your live streams as videos for whatever purpose you want to make sure one you live stream to facebook two you record locally and that's possible using obs and all you gotta do guys is when you go live to facebook you just need to hit the go live button in obs but also hit the record button in obs but it's not as simple as just hitting the record button there are specific settings you have to respect when it comes to recording your content or recording your live stream so to make sure you nail those settings make sure you check out this video right here but also if you have never live streamed to facebook and you want to know the best settings for live streaming to facebook i'm gonna link another video showing you how to do that right here so check them out guys and i'll see you there take care